Um, I have been making music for a long time, singing since I can record. Always, you know this, <laughs> always singing, always being obnoxious and just doing whatever I can to make everybody happy and smile and laugh. And I like that I can do that through something that I happen to be okay at. <laughs> well, she's the one with the bright pink hair. It's hard to miss. <laughs> what would I want you to say? Yes, what would you want me to say? I think I, I, it's definitely significant how much I've grown, not only through music, but just, I mean, I haven't grown. That's not yeah, you're still the same height. Yeah. Let's, let's but you know what I mean. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, my experiences and everything have changed in my environment, especially from being down south so much. Um, so that's really influenced a lot of, you know, the whole cultural thing has really influenced more so my music influences, mm -hmm. especially with my original stuff lately. But yeah, I mean, I just want to have fun. So. Yeah. I mean, I've done this challenge before, yep. I've done the karaoke challenge before, and I won that. Um, I have done the anthem a lot around this area, particularly for men's games, races, stuff like that. Um, and um, I've done a lot of shows between here and the south, mm -hmm. all on, along the east coast. Um, yeah. I'm just kind of doing a lot of gigs, and if that means singing for a bunch of drunk old guys that aren't listening, then at least I'm singing my songs, right? <laughs> I mean, I wake up, and my guitars are right by my bed, and that's the first thing I do, and that's the last thing I do every day, and I'm always singing. I mean, I sing constantly, my siblings hate me, and <laughs> I just, I want to make music all the time. It's just the one thing that I know I can have with me all the time that I, nobody can ever take away, so it's just kind of cool to know that, like, no matter what I'm doing, I can always express whatever is going on with me or whether it's I'm being obnoxious and idiotic and I think that I'm funny and making up words or raps or something or you know something significant is really going on not only with me or my community or something like that last song I just wrote was kind of an outreach to everybody that was just going through a really hard time while I was there and everybody was here and so it's kind of cool that I can like use that no matter where I am traveling and doing this and, and the business that I can still touch base with everybody no matter where you are what would you say you know you know i hear it all the time and i'm sure you've heard it before oh country music sucks it's, a, it's all about know, trucks and about dogs drugs, mud and, yeah, <laughs> exactly what do you right. want to say to somebody that says that to you i don't care <laughs> right? do you i guess for me country music is always kind of you know not only was it the only radio station that we got from where we're from, but it just means so much more because while well, you think it's about trucks and everything else, that's really all we got out there. So it's just kind of like a cultural thing, I guess, and it doesn't bother me at all. So what would you say to the judges or the potential voters right now? I would open with a joke. All right, do it. All right. What did the astronaut's wife say when he proposed in space? I have no idea. What did the astronaut's wife say when he proposed in space? <laughs> she said, I can't breathe. Right? And then you laugh. Yeah. And I then did. I sing, and you're like, whoop. Give us your best reaction if you were to win the Visions Country Hitmaker Challenge right now. 